Hey, what's up guys, Boba Rail here, and today we're going to be talking about 45 ACP and why I think it's one of the last things that need to be changed in Vigor's weapon balance. I think this caliber is way too weak as is, and I'll explain why specifically and what changes to make in this video. So this may seem like a rather insignificant caliber, since 45 is only shot out of three guns, the Thompson, the Grease Gun, and the M1911. But these three guns are what I would argue to be some of the most important in Vigor's progression, as they are some of the first guns that are provided to new players. They are what somebody is going to base their first impressions of the game's gunplay off of, so making them feel especially well balanced or rewarding to use would in theory increase the retention of new players, or at least have some effect on it. So what's wrong with them as they are now and what do we need to do to fix them? Well, primarily it's damage, but their controllability and bloom isn't very good either. They all currently sit at 6 shots to kill, with the Thompson mysteriously doing a little bit less than the other two. This is absolutely terrible in comparison to other guns of similar caliber like 9mm, which are all a very close 5 shot to kill. But they also have significantly higher bullet velocity, and the guns that shoot them have less recoil, so 9mm as a caliber is just much better than 45 ACP. But back to what needs to change with 45. It needs to perform like a pistol round, so I'd say in extreme close quarters, like 10 to 15 meters, it should be a 4 shot, and then beyond that it should do the same as 9mm at 5, and eventually taper off to 6 at like 50 meters. This would make it similar in time to kill to the AKM in extreme close range exclusively, but the lack of bullet velocity and stopping power behind it would still make it lose to all 4 shot ARs at mid to long distance. So you would have a gun that's strong enough to feel powerful and easy to use, but it would still lose out to other guns that are just one step above it in rarity. It's good enough to be usable, but not good enough that it outclasses things that it shouldn't. Overall, this would just make new players have a solid option to go to that would consistently be able to win gunfights if they land a greater than or equal to amount of shots on their opponents. I'll put it this way. If the Thompson player can manage to close the distance and play to the gun's strengths instead of trying to outrange an assault rifle, I think they should be able to compete with that enemy in chest shot bullets to kill. Sorry, I know that was a lot, but I really just wanted to hammer home the point that just because it's the first gun in Vigor's progression doesn't mean it should be comparatively unusable to an inexperienced player. If anything, they should be pretty easy to learn how to use so the new players get a better sense of the game's balance overall earlier on. Anyways, yeah, that's the 45 ACP buff proposal. I'm sure some people are going to say this would make them OP and too strong for early game, but I just really view them as too weak right now in comparison to the rest of the game's balancing, and I think it's negatively impacting the player retention of Vigor. But that's just my opinion, and of course everybody has the right to disagree and bring other ideas to the table in the comments. Anyways, that's all I've got for you guys today. This has been Bobo Rail from the Christopher Beast channel, and I'll catch you all in the next one.